Computers in classrooms has always been a 21st century idea for educating students for the future. Urban Street has found a specially developed new courseware, which challenges and excites students. The national reference site for this uniquely powerful computer program is in the heart of one of Chicago's poorest communities. Urban Street traveled to John Foster Dulles to take a closer look at this computer program, which applies technology at the point of instruction. It's certainly a long-standing fact that knowledge is power, but one central question arises, how does one learn how to learn? IBM Corporation is committed to ensuring educational success with the highly praised and very successful program called IBM EduQuest. After hearing about this newly developed computer program set up in the heart of the inner city of Chicago, the Urban Street News team headed toward John Foster Dulles Elementary School. Meet Principal Donna Clayton, the person responsible for bringing the idea of computers in the classroom to Dulles. In being a new principal, my first thought was, how can I put Dulles School on the map? And in thinking and many hours of labor and talking with my teachers and talking with different people, I started to think towards technology. Since this is the age of technology, the age of information, the most important thing is making our children here at Dulles at 6311 South Calumet computer literate. Because when they get out in this big world and trying to find their niche, they must be ready. Every school day begins in the Writing to Read lab with a special credo for success. We started the writing to read about three years ago, the old version, and I can see a big improvement in the reading scores. The kids are thrilled about coming into this lab. They're really learning. They know how to encode and decode words, so they're reading. And what happens here, the kid just follows the direction. The computer will lead them through. It gives them an opportunity to stop, understand what they're doing, and then keep going. What this does is this help increases their higher order thinking skills, whereas other pieces of software, the computer does everything. Here we got the student and the computer working together. The software for the IBM EduQuest system was developed by a statewide team of teachers and marketing personnel at IBM. The development of software actually starts from K through 12, and the executives of IBM got together and decided that with just having computers is not enough. You have to be a complete solution provider. So the courseware is probably the most important thing when you're looking at long-term use. Uh, we start out with the writing to read program all the way up to the PALS program. The PALS is for the higher learning. Okay, so let's put your B right there, right here. Okay, now put your cards. Well, we have the two hands. Two new hands. Writing to Read 2000, which is a big improvement okay. over the, other, the old version. We also have the Abacus okay. program that will enable the teachers to make their see. own tests, right uh, grade, you know, run their grading system through the computer. They will learn how to do all of that. So basically, it's a lifesaver. You can do your lesson plans on the computer. You, it'll work. After three years of very hard work, John Foster Dulles has become the national reference site for IBM EduQuest. What this means is people from all over the city and country will come to our school to see just what we have done with technology. On the plaque we have, in recognition of your distinguished leadership in technology and school improvement, Donna Clayton, Principal, Brenda Ford, Technology Coordinator, Pat Wells, Technology Teacher. And this is our vision, our mission statement on the plaque. 
Ellis fosters an atmosphere in which children develop a sense of purpose and relevance of gaining an education. Students and parents view Dallas as a resource of information. Our school is a place where all children come to learn and all teachers come to teach. We were able to find a school that was willing to participate, and that's the most important piece. If you don't get the buy-in from the teachers or the principals, it will never happen, because then you get the pushback. Dulles is the one that was willing and able, and then with George, George's, George coming in and being able to work with them, they were excited about doing it, and that's what you need is the excitement from the staff. I have to admit that it was a difficult situation at first, but with Donna's help and her teachers and the principal working together, Yes, we made it happen. Out of 400.